What's up everybody? Welcome to the bit where we bring you bite-sized news from inside the gaming industry. It's April 27th, 2016. My name is Matt. I'm feeling a little bit under the weather, but let's get right to the news. Nintendo of America has been very secretive recently when it comes to their upcoming endeavors. That includes the Nintendo NX and the release of the next mainstream Zelda title. And something tells me that was intentional because today, Nintendo tweeted out this. Not only will the Nintendo NX not be showcased at E3, it will not make a holiday 2016 release. Instead, it will release sometime in March of 2017. The delays do not stop there though. Oh no, Zelda Wii U as we've been calling it has also been delayed again. It will not make a 2016 release and instead is being pushed back to 2017 so that it can release simultaneously on both the Nintendo NX and the Nintendo Wii U. The silver lining being that now we have a launch window for Zelda Wii U, or Zelda Wii U and NX as we should probably start calling it, March 2017. Assuming that Nintendo does want to release the title alongside the Nintendo NX in order to capitalize on the game's popularity to help sell future hardware. Now, that being said, we should see a lot of Zelda Wii U footage come E3 of this year because Nintendo did follow up by saying that this year at E3, they will be focusing solely on the Legend of Zelda series. Releasing on both the Nintendo NX and the Nintendo Wii U is something that I didn't think Nintendo was going to do, but it does tell you a few things right off the bat. Like, for instance, this is more than likely because of a marketing scheme. Like, they want to use Zelda to sell the new hardware, and that would be perfectly fine if this was any other company, but because it's a Nintendo, there's going to be a catch, like there's got to be some exclusive gameplay mechanic, exclusive, um, you know, gimmick, or something like that that's going to entice people to buy it on the NX and not the Wii U, and that could be a good thing or a bad thing, only time will tell. It also tells me that Nintendo has pretty much given up on the Wii U at this point, like it's no secret that the Wii U has been a failure by Nintendo's standards, but not giving the console its own exclusive Zelda title is a huge deal because, think about it, up until this point, every single Nintendo console has had its own exclusive Zelda game. The NES had Zelda 1 and 2, Super Nintendo had A Link to the Past, uh, N64 had Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask, GameCube had Wind Waker, and of course, the Wii had a Skyward Sword, so they're breaking that trend by not giving the Wii U its own exclusive Zelda title, and when a company as large as Nintendo breaks a trend they've had since like the very beginning, it says something. Not only that, but think about it, we don't know the specs of the Nintendo NX yet. We do know the Wii U runs on a PowerPC style processor, and the rumor that's been going around recently is that the Nintendo NX will make use of an x86 style processor which would mean that Zelda Wii would have to go through a lot of modification to run on that newer style of processor since they work vastly different than PowerPC. Or it could mean that Nintendo plans on sticking with PowerPC in the Nintendo NX, which I really don't think is the case. Like, if they want to appeal to third parties, it would make way more sense to upgrade x86 since that's what both the Xbox One and PS4 use. Anyways, that's going to do it for this pilot episode of The Bit, which is my news show, that's what I'm calling it. I know it was a little bit rough around the edges, guys, but that's because I'm not exactly done with it just yet. Like, there's still a whole lot of other assets and, like, graphics that I need to create, but this news was so big, I decided to take what I had and, uh, try and make it work. So, it's a little bit rough right now, but I promise you, once I'm actually done, it should be a lot smoother. So please, if you have any feedback, leave it in the comments down below. Also, let me know what you think about this crazy Zelda and, uh, you know, Nintendo NX news in the comments down below because I'm sure you guys have a lot to say, as do I. That being said, though, we're going to end things off here. So if you guys enjoyed this video, a like rating would be greatly appreciated. If you want to see more, consider subscribing. But once again, guys, my name is Matt. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. I am never recording when I'm sick again. Holy crap, that was awful.